What's good, South Jersey? I'm Isaiah Showell, and I'm standing here in Westville at the Verga Fire Company because Miss Kenya Linton of the Hustling Spirit is doing it again, encouraging people to make their own way and achieve their goals and essentially make their own table in life. It's definitely what's good in South Jersey this week. Miss Kenya Linton, founder of the TKL movement, is opening doors for vendors in South Jersey to network while empowering them to make tables or opportunities for themselves and not wait for others to do so. So the whole intention of this event is empowerment. We wanted to create a space for individuals to see vision, see purpose. A lot of people have all these dreams and desires in their hearts, but they never see anybody doing it that looks like them. So this space is to create platforms, tables, if you would, of people stepping out on their passions, stepping out on fear, okay, and walking out in faith and doing what their purpose and their calling is, you know, called to do. So that's what today is all about. There was a Christian fashion show led by Mr. Arthur Burgest of Philadelphia Christian Fashion Week, Body Butters by Miss Joanne Furby of Patty's Puddings, and musical selections from Miss Fantastic Noise. We being a faith-based entity, I want to show people that it doesn't matter what that thing is. It could be fashion, it can be uh, whatever business you think it, it could be a car wash, I don't care what it is, you can show people Christ through it. So this runway is our altar, it's our pulpit, and, and this is how we spread the message of Jesus Christ to everybody. Let's say you come home from anything, you know, you take a nice shower, um, you make sure you, um, you take a nice shower, you just want to get out, you want to put something on that's natural, but you can still go to bed with it. A light scent, you know, but something that's going to moisturize you so when you wake up the next morning, you're feeling good. Now, it reminds you, you can use it all day. It's not just something for night. It's just something that I find most people say, I put it on at night. I put it on my feet when I put my socks on. It's, it's a whole body moisturizer, not just one. I love all music. I love it from gospel to pop to folk to jazz. So when you see me, it's, it's a combination of things. I never want to be in a box. So I love gospel, but I also love some Aretha Franklin. I also love some Eric Rob Beat. Like, I love them all. So when you see me, you just see me as a noise maker. I'm out here just making noise and hoping people enjoy all the noise that I'm making. Miss A.J. Moore of A.J. Moore Consulting Corporation also shared her story in hopes of encouraging others in the room while Ms. Sheila Horn shares her new book entitled Satisfied and Set Free. I never stopped believing in myself. I never stopped believing. So I know I went through some things. I knew how I was feeling, but I know it didn't take anything away from my mind. I'm a thinker, you know, I'm a thinker. I'm smart, I'm gifted, I know I am. You know, I started my first business at the age of 11, you know, so I was babysitting for money to help my mom pay the bills when my dad left, you know. So I know that I'm a thinker. No one can take these things away from me. And yeah, there was a lot of pedophiles, a lot of bad things that happened to me. I'm being human by feeling it. You know, I was oppressed by it. Um, but again, I didn't let it stop me believing in myself. So my book is Satisfied and Set Free, The Sex Life of a Licensed and Ordained Evangelist. God said they're not talking about sex in the church, but they're having plenty of it. And he had to bring exposure so that he could bring deliverance. And it started with my story. This is my story. Special thanks to Ms. Kenya Linton for opening the doors for South Jersey vendors to talk about their products and network, and for all the vendors that made time to participate. In Westville, I'm Isaiah Showell, and that's what's good in South Jersey this week.